you know, when you're in flooded timber like this here, like I am on, on Sam Raven Reservoir here, um, that Echo 175, I tell you, it's a great, great crankbait. This water in here, it's, it's like one to three feet deep. Um, usually the lake's not this high. You know, it's got a lot of flooded timber from what I understand. Um, so, I mean, it's kind of cool for me because I love fishing this way. I love fishing real super shallow. Um, but the lake is falling, so I don't know how much longer it'll be like this. But uh, that little 175, I mean, it's perfect. It deflects off the stuff, it bounces off. And uh, it's got that, it's got that Bill Lewis sound, man. And uh, you just can't go wrong. It's got shad patterns. It's got the, you know, chartreuse. I know a lot of you guys are chartreuse shiner guys. And uh, all the crawdad stuff. I love the crawdad stuff. I'm going to get back to that, that Raven Red. But uh, good stuff. Give it a shot. That Echo 175 is awesome. That is so cool. That Echo's just bumping off of stuff. There's so much wood down there. So much wood, stumps, vines, weeds. Whenever you, whenever you feel an obstruction, you just slow down a little bit and that echo is so buoyant. It just, it just bounces right back up, just backs right back up out of all that cover. Just a great little shallow water crankbait. And I'm talking skinny shallow. I'm talking bad, ugly in the dirt shallow. Oh, we missed it. Oh. oh, get it, girl. Oh, get out of there. Oh, get out of there. Oh, that is so awesome. That is so awesome. I tell you. That dog on echo. That echo back in the trees, boy, that is so cool. The beauty of that echo, that's a nice bass right there, that's pretty. Is is, you know, like I say, I'm back here. I'm back here and it's one to three feet deep. And um, I can manipulate this thing right here. There's some high spots. There's some spots where it's like a foot deep, and then it's two, and then it's three. And wherever it's a foot. I'll raise my rod up and this echo just cruises right along, touches the bottom in one. And then as I come over that ridge, as I come over the ridge and I'm bumping the ridge and then it starts to get deeper, then I'll drop my rod tip and I'll stay down in that two to three zone. And this is, man, I tell you, target fishing 101. I tell guys all the time, learn how to cast. Guys ask me, say, hey man, you know, what color jig should I throw? What color spinnerbait? What color crankbait? What color echo? You know, all this is, you know, important and all that kind of stuff. Learn how to cast learn how to cast and everything else will fall into place and then a lot of times color won't matter but it's all up here the color right here. a lot of times come on oh she's got one hook on her come on she's on that stick that's the thing with this and you're back Oh, God, come here. Come here. You're gonna lose some of them. That was pretty cool. Boy, she was in it. You know the deal with these guys. You're gonna, you're gonna lose some of them. It's just, it's just the way it is. Not the biggest bass in the world, but it's a lot of fun. Toothy guys like to eat that doggone echo. 
I'll tell you what, that's been a lot of fun. Uh, tossing that echo around in that shallow water, you know, it's not, hey, there's a lot of other ways to catch bass sometimes, but I'll tell you what, if you want a real challenge and if you want to work on your, your pitching and, and your casting accuracy and all that kind of stuff, that's a great bait to do it with when you get in them shallow areas where you got just short, accurate throws, short, accurate throws, just, you know, sometimes it's eight to 12 feet, you know, sometimes it's, you know, five or six yards, something like that. Get you a couple of echoes like that, get that shallow water crankbait thing going, wine stop, wine stop, medium heavy graphite rod, because you, you know, you want one that's got a little bit of juice, because you got to turn them around, you're going to lose some fish in here, I mean, for sure, but, but uh, it's a good time. So give that echo a shot. Talk to you soon. So anyway, this is Bobby Barrick signing out from Bobby Barrick's Bass Class on YouTube from Sam Rayburn Reservoir. Big Sam, they call it. This is a big place, I tell you. It's awesome.